What's going on YouTube? This is Mustafa Love with Hearthstone Media. Thanks for tuning in again. But if this is your first time checking out the channel, you're mad late because I make videos like this all the time. But without further ado, let's get to this video because guys, I'm still riding high for my week one. 21 to 20 come from behind victory against Tennessee Titans. Giants within one. And in this video, I'm going to be handing out my MVP nod for week one of the NFL season. So let's get to it. Now, guys, I will preclude this video by saying last year we were god awful. We were a god awful team and we were god awful at many aspects of the game. Here's Lee Baltimore. A couple of scores will all be updated at the half. Interesting formation. I, I mean, really, you're at the four yard line and, and you, you don't feel comfortable enough in your offense to be able to run a traditional play. I mean, I, I get the first one when you put yourself kind of. Many facets of the ball. That's defense, offense, special teams, run game, passing game. Kicking game, well, the kicking game was solid because Graham Beno was solid as a kicker. He probably was our MVP last season, but we had terrible injuries. We had a depleted wide receiver core. Our weapons were hurt. Our offensive line was god-awful. And in this game, we show, oh, not to mention, our coaching was god-awful as well. And that started from the top down with Joe Judge. And oh, the only bright spot was probably Patrick Graham. He did the most with what he had and what he had to work with with the offense that could not move the ball. So I will say this, it is known that we need to improve in every facet to be competitive this season. And I think we saw a lot of that and not give up a lot of points. We actually held the team to 20 points or less, something that we did very infrequently last season. But we showed improvement in so many facets of the game. Now it would be very easy for me to give my MVP nod to one Mr. Saquon. But the defense for holding King Henry and the Tennessee Titans to 20 points. There's a lot of people who could get this MVP. I can give the MVP to Brian Day Balls, as we're calling him now, for deciding to go for two points and go for the win and make some gutsy calls in that game. But no, that would be all too easy. And that's not how we're going to do things this season over here at Hearthstone Media. That's definitely not how I'm going to do things. My MVP goes to one Mr. Jamie Gillen. I will now have a dramatic pause if you have no idea who Jamie Gillen is. Jamie Gillen is in fact our punter. Now I just said that we were bad and terrible at every facet of the game last season, but for dramatics, I left this one out. We were god awful at the punting position. Riley Dixon probably had the worst year as a punter. Maybe in the history of the game. There's no need to pull stats out. Riley Dixon was terrible from the eye test, from the visuals, from what he did as a punter. He couldn't do rally and it hurt us immensely because our offense was inept at moving the ball in this game our offense was very inadequate at moving the ball early in the game and had it not been for some very 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 we weren't winning the field possession battle because we weren't able to move the sticks but he had some very 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 well placed well timed punts he pinned them out of his six punts he pinned them inside the 20 on five of them he had that boomer that led to the muff punt and the fumble recovery that stalled their drive even though we didn't score on that drive they weren't able to score on that drive and i ran with the hair punting so jamie gillen sir this may be the first mvp award you've ever gotten in your entire life as a punter or period but you just got one from heartstorm media week one mr jamie gillen goes on the list MVP number one for the 2022 season. With that being said, guys, I'm out. If you want to watch another Giants or Knicks related video, you can start by clicking right here. One.